What's up everyone and welcome back to my channel. So I'm working on this really beat up Hyundai and it, I need to do an iron decontamination on the whole thing, but the car's kind of big and I get like trigger fatigue on uh, the trigger when I'm constantly pumping it to get all the iron remover uh, out of the bottle. So I came up with this kind of interesting idea and I wanted to show it to you guys. I put an iron remover and I diluted it a little bit into a foaming pump sprayer. So I wanna show you what it looks like out on the car and actually how you can move around the car much quicker with an iron remover. And it's kind of a hack that I haven't seen a lot of people do. So let's go check it out. All right, hopefully the camera's picking this up. Honestly, it's so freaking bright out here, I can't even tell. So I got the iron remover. I have it diluted in the pump sprayer. And you can just see, so I messed up. I think in the intro I said the pump sprayer, the foaming pump sprayer. You don't want it in the foaming sprayer because this is what you get. You get foam. What you want it in is just a regular sprayer that sprays out like normal. But you could see how quickly you can get around this whole car And sure, you're pumping, but you're actually spreading a little less. You're going to get a better coverage over the entire car. And I'm just going to do the hood, and you can see it kind of reacting. And I'll talk about it as I go around. But especially if you're mobile, I'm not mobile today, but if you are mobile and you need to get around a car very quick and you want to do an iron contamination, this is by far one of the quickest ways that you can get around the entire car. Do the hood. I can't wait to see all the flack I'm going to get for using an iron remover in direct sunlight. Oh boy. Oh boy. But I'm doing this in real time as you guys kind of watch the hood turn purple. But I'm already more than halfway around the entire car. I'm already working on the back deck lid. I already got the it'd be a fun comparison actually to see how long it would take you to trigger spray this whole entire car and if we start drying up I'll watch it if we start drying up I'll rinse it but I think I'm gonna be able to get around this whole entire car within just a couple minutes so I'm already back to the hood however long that was back to the hood drying out a little bit so I'm gonna rinse it But yeah, look at that. Bada bing, bada boom. All right, so what did you think? Are you gonna be doing the iron remover pump sprayer technique or does it just take up too much iron remover uh, product? Does it take up too much product, especially an iron remover being one of, more, one of the more premium products or more expensive? This is definitely where you wanna opt for like the turtle wax iron remover that can be diluted uh, or at least in a bigger, you're gonna want a product that is in a bigger container if you're gonna be going through it. Uh, but I like it because I don't get that trigger fatigue and I can move around the whole car in, a lot faster than with a spray bottle, especially if I'm working out in the sun because uh, I don't want the stench of the iron remover in, in uh, my shop. But let me know what you think. Have you tried this before? Am I just late to the party? Love to know in the comments below. See ya.